everyone, and welcome to Flowing Con. My name is Eli Fisher. I'm the product manager lead at AWS working on the OpenSearch project. I'm excited to join you today to talk a bit about why FluentBit, FluentD, and OpenSearch make for a great end-to-end -end log analytics solution. To quickly go over what I'm going to cover, first, we'll talk about what OpenSearch is and what use cases it's used for. Then we will dive into why FluentBit and FluentD and OpenSearch are often used together. So what is the OpenSearch project? The OpenSearch project is a search and analytics suite derived from Apache 2.0, Elasticsearch, and Kibana 7.10.2. It's an open source and community-driven project. It consists of a search engine, OpenSearch, a dashboard analytics UI, OpenSearch dashboards, and a number of plugins and tools that add advanced functionality for things like advanced security, alerting, anomaly detection, k-nearest neighbor search, and observability features, and much more. There are a variety of use cases OpenSearch is popular for. First, text search. It is a search engine after all. There are natural language processing features. It's built on top of the popular Lucene search library. And there are a range of ways to optimize relevancy and ranking. It's also popular as a document store for ingesting streaming data. So let's say, for example, you have a bunch of IoT sensors and you want to ingest all of the data from the sensors and do analytics. OpenSearch is well suited for that. It has um, high throughput, near real-time ingestion, and it's a distributed system, so it can horizontally scale to meet high volumes of data. Last, it's popular for analytics, and more specifically, log analytics. This is because it provides built-in dashboarding, aggregation functions to do statistical analysis, and it has search features that allow you to home in on what's driving specific trends in your data. So where do FluentBit and FluentD come in? Well, you can't analyze logs without collecting and formatting them. First, you're going to need to collect them and forward the logs. FluentBit is a great choice for that. It's fast, it's lightweight, and it's scalable. You can do stream processing with SQL, and you can parse multiple log formats. It has reliability features like back pressure handling and data buffering. It's also secure with support for things like SSL and a number of different authentication mechanisms. It's also extensible with over 70 plugins for data sources, outputs, and much more. This has led people to to use it for a number of different use cases and driven its popularity. In fact, it has over a billion downloads. And last but not least, it has some built-in support for OpenSearch. Okay, so now you're collecting your logs and you need a central layer to ingest and route them to your analytics tool of choice. Well, that's where FluentD can come in. FluentD allows you to unify data collection from multiple log sources and process that data for analysis. Fluentd has over 500 plugins for data sources, outputs, parsers, and much more. This allows you to customize it for your specific use case. Like Fluentbit, like Fluentbit, it's also widely used, and it also has support for OpenSearch. So what does end-to-end -end log analytics look like when using Fluent and OpenSearch? Well, let's say you have three apps and you want to do a log analysis on them. First, you're going to need to collect logs. And that's where FluentBit's going to come in. It will help you collect and ship those logs to your central logging processing layer. And that's where FluentD comes in. It's going to be what's used to process those logs and get them into a format for analysis. From there, you can ship them into OpenSearch, and then you can do analysis on OpenSearch dashboards uh, to do all of your log analytics. So if you're curious to learn more, there are a number of resources to check out. There are two blogs on how to get started with FluentBit, FluentD, and OpenSearch that I highly recommend. You can also check out the project websites. If you're interested in contributing, that's great. We welcome contributors. There are a number of different ways to contribute. You can check out the project GitHub repos and write code for them. You can also author blogs or just join a community meeting. With that said, I'd like to give a shout out to Calyptia who partnered with the OpenSearch project team to launch both the FluentBit and FluentD connectors. Many thanks to them for their contributions. And I'd also like to give everyone here thanks for listening to this presentation. Now, most importantly, go enjoy the conference.